welcome home. All right, what's going on guys? It's Epoxy and I've been seeing a lot of people making the assumption or just simply being worried that Fallout 4 New Vegas, the Fallout 4 mod that is recreating Fallout New Vegas in the Fallout 4 engine is being canceled or has already been canceled. And to put your worries to rest or your assumptions to rest, that is the farthest from the truth. Fallout 4 The Capital Wasteland was cancelled due to the team wanting to use the original audio files and nothing else. Bethesda didn't shut down that mod, they're just simply unable to give that mod team the permission they wanted for the audio files. Bethesda does not have the right to give people permission to use audio files that they don't legally own themselves. They only have the license to use it in Fallout 3 and nothing else. That is why the mod was cancelled. So it is understandable that you would assume Fallout 4 New Vegas would be cancelled following the wake of this announcement from the Capital Wasteland team. Thankfully though, that is not the case. This comes directly from Metamoth, one of the project leads for Fallout 4 New Vegas. As many folks are aware, another major Fallout 4 mod project, Fallout 4 The Capital Wasteland, has recently discontinued development due to issues relying on importation of audio files from the original game Fallout 3. The same process is one the team Fallout 4 New Vegas had been planning on relying on, but recent discussions with staff from Bethesda clarified that this was not an option. After some internal discussion and planning, we at Team Fallout 4 New Vegas have chosen to carry on with development of Fallout 4 New Vegas with some adjustments to our project goals to suit this change in production requirements. To fit with the requirements put in place for projects such as our own, Fall for New Vegas will now utilize custom voice acting work in place of the originals from Fallout New Vegas. This will be a separate part of the work done by Team Fallout 4 New Vegas running parallel to the main project development process. What this means from an outside perspective is that the work done by the voice acting team will not utilize resources from the core development team and while it will remain core to the Fallout 4 New Vegas experience due to realities of unpaid voice acting work, any public releases of Fallout 4 New Vegas will not be informed by the presence of voiceover work. Fallout New Vegas had around half a year straight of recorded dialogue. Developing this any other way could set this project back for years. And for those of us on Team Fallout 4 New Vegas who would like to share and play this project within their lifetimes, we feel that this is the best possible route forward. Voice acting recruitment has not yet officially opened. When the time comes that we have all the needed infrastructure in place for that, we'll make a public announcement about that. So there you have it. Following the discussion with Bethesda clarifying that audio files can't legally be used in any manner, the Fallout 4 New Vegas team have decided to continue work on the mod and plan on re-recording all voiceover work in Fallout New Vegas. But I just wanted to share that awesome news with you guys because a lot of people were confused on whether or not this was going to impact Fallout 4 New Vegas in any way. And it is going to impact Fallout 4 New Vegas in the way that they're gonna to have to re-record all the voice files. But thankfully, they are not canceling their project like that of Fallout 4 The Capital Wasteland project. So let me know your thoughts down in the comment section below, but that's it for this video. If you enjoyed, please smack that like button down below and subscribe to join the good fights if you haven't already. It would be super greatly appreciated as always. And until next time, this is Epoxy, signing off. Today.